For a moment, we're going to talk about the very greatest Christmas present, boys and girls, men and women of all ages, the very greatest Christmas present that anyone has ever received. And that can be yours this very year if you want it. Listen to how this all came about the world's greatest Christmas present. In those days, Caesar Augustus issued a decree that a census should be taken of all the Roman world. This was the first census that took place while Quirinius was governor in Syria. And everyone went to their own town to be registered. So Joseph went up from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea, to Bethlehem, the town of David, because he belonged to the house and the line of David. He went there to register with Mary, who was pledged to be married to him and was expecting a child. And while they were there, the time came for the child to be born. And she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. And she wrapped him in cloths and placed him in a manger because there were no guest rooms available for them. And there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby and they were keeping watch over their flocks at night. And an angel of the Lord, an angel of the Lord appeared to them. And the glory of the Lord shone around them and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all people. Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find the baby wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. Suddenly, a great company of the heavenly host appeared with the angel, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace to those whom His favor rests. And when the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let us go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has told us about. So, they hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and the baby lying in a manger. And when they had seen, they spread the word concerning what they had been told them about this child. And all who heard it were amazed at what had happened and the, uh, to the shepherds. But Mary treasured up all these things and pondered them in her heart. Shepherds returned glorifying and praising God. They were glorifying and praising God for all the things they had heard and seen, which was just as they had been told. God Himself, the Father, had sent to you, to you, the very best Christmas present ever. He is the Lord that takes our sin away so that we can live with Him and the Father and all who believe forever and ever. 
What an amazing gift.